Hello everybody, it's Isabel from Horses Travel Vlogs. I hope everybody's going good. I am doing okay. I am uh, doing a video today about what's upcoming on the channel like I haven't posted for a bit of a time and uh, I will tell you why. Um, so lately, as you know, uh, these this last year and a half, I had to move away from the stable I was uh, boarding at uh, that had um, a ring in indoor arena. Uh, I think I have uh, covered this story on the channel already, so um, go check it out and also go check the yard tour of the place I was at. So yes, the place where I was uh, was quite um, a yard, you know, there wasn't any uh, ring, um, it was mostly char riding, um, and when there was too much snow, you know, you could not really go out. Um, I went, I, I rode a bit more than last year. Uh, I wanted a little bit more trail riding, but um, for the rest, I didn't really do much more. Um, but the news is I'm not there anymore, and I will explain this um, now. So, 2020 hasn't been great a great year, as you know, like uh, there was the pandemic. I didn't uh, show, the shows were cancelled, and, you know, the year was pretty boring, if I can say. I worked most of my summer, and the start of 2021 was very sad for me. Um, I think I've already talked about my grandfather on the channel in my travel vlogs and my grandfather unfortunately passed away so um, this has been something that uh, has been keeping me very busy um, so I was really more inclined into taking care of this and taking care of my job and my personal health uh, than trying to update you guys on the channel. I am updating you guys on Instagram and Facebook if you're following me and I even created TikTok which uh, are Instagram and TikTok are under Horse Panda CA and the Facebook page, which is still the same, that should be in the description as Botted Image AK Jack. Uh, and I have been updating on this page since a few weeks now. But I do agree before I was completely dead silent. Uh, on this page I didn't know what to post like I didn't really do anything like I didn't really want to share the pictures of the yard I was at because it wasn't really the best place and I, I was kind of scared you know just to get comments why is your horse there and blah 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 and blah 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 um, and so on so That's the thing. Um, just to be clear, uh, everything about my grandfather is still going on. Um, so I'll probably sometimes be there but leaving blanks because I do still have to go take care of that. But you should have more content. And that's where I have to talk about the content on the channel. Because I am thinking about opening a new channel. I will be honest and I will tell you why I am opening a new channel. Um, 
in the mid 2020 uh, I was looking at a property for sale that was before at a higher price but they put it down and I said to myself there's a possibility for me to maybe buy this property like it was the price was lowered so I spend uh, my end of August and beginning of September to invest and see if I could take care of this property and I am officially the owner now of this property since the beginning of April so it is a farm it is a house a four bedroom house with two bathroom kitchen and uh, dining room and I am also uh, owner of a seven stall barn with tack room and clubhouse um, and this property has the humongous ring we also have a round pen, but we don't really know where to put it yet. Um, usually it's in the ring, but I don't really want it in the ring, but that we will, it will be something we will be talking on the channel about. So I am very happy uh, to have purchased this property because it's my dream property and I can finally have my horses at home. You will ask why I'm still in the apartment right now. So we have um, we have agreed to leave the house to the current owners until June, even mid June. Uh, but we are taking possession of the barn in the horse boarding business from May, May, which is pretty much in less than a month <laughs> I know people will have questions about all these transactions and if you do I would invite you to let them in the comments because they will be used for a frequently asked question video on my new channel why do I want to make a new channel? Being a horse barn owner, it's very different than what's on the channel right now. And I want to reserve a part uh, to what it is to be owning and doing stuff on a property during COVID. The pandemic has struck hard and you can even feel it in owning some terrain and stuff like that because you have to fix things and the materials are not always the prices that they were a year ago. And I know I will be sharing this adventure and everything that's happening. I will be filming the most time. So right now I will be phoning, fo uh, not phoning, filming mostly with my cell phone in a tripod. But eventually I will be having a gimbal a camera uh, that will have an active track so it will be able to track me around for example auto rotate if I move in the in the in the um, in the yard or stuff like that and I will also be able to have a mic on me so you will hear me loud, loud and clear even if there is a bucket of winds and stuff like that I am motivated to get an equipment upgrade. I even want to buy a mini drone. And doing this, I really want a new channel. 
The new channel will be the name of my stables, which are Woodrunner Stables. This is a new name um, that I'm putting in place when uh, we will officially be uh, running the stable. And we will also have a live channel on Twitch. So sometimes we will be doing lives and we will be sharing our lives or doing Q&A's on live. And that's really where I, I want you guys to come and interact with us because you might have questions. Uh, and these are questions that I could reuse in a frequently asked question or Q&A video. I really want to talk a lot with my viewers and be asked the problems and the expenses. I am not scared of sharing prices with you. Um, I can be honestly transparent about everything that is happening with this project. I will tell you, I'm pretty lucky. The house is in great shape. The barn is in great shape. We more have projects around the property we want to do. And we will document these projects, of course. So this is the exciting news. It doesn't seem in my face that I'm really, really happy. But don't worry, I'm really, really happy. It's just with what happened recently in the beginning of 2021. It doesn't seem on my face, but I am very, very, very happy. And to finish off this video, my horse moved there um, less than a month uh, at the property. He has maybe been there for two weeks and a half. And he's there now, and I have been doing a lot of things. I have been going trail riding, I have been doing things in the ring, riding him. Um, he, he's staying active. Um, he even scared me a little bit. And if you want to know about all these stories, I will invite you to follow our Facebook page where um, I put a description in English and one in French. Um, every time I can so it's not always every day uh, due to the fact that like I said I'm busy and I'm working but uh, definitely you will at least have one post uh, or two posts a week so that's a little bit you know reassuring <laughs> it's not like before where I was dead silence and people were worrying about me like how is your horse doing we're not having any news and you know he's fine um, and He's doing really good right now. Um, and of course, I will have a lot of videos on the channel about my horses, the story of my horses. Uh, also, we are maybe looking into purchasing a horse for my girlfriend. Uh, so they will be some videos out. Um, I can assure you that. And I am very, very, very forward to see you on the new channel. So anyone that was very, very interested in the equestrian um, and the ranch owning business, I will invite you to follow this YouTube channel that should be created very soon, but it will be named Woodrunner Stables. So keep an eye and I will probably post a video when the channel will be available. Uh, but I kind of want to do the channel, make sure the art is good, and um, put a video, a video, even if it's a cell phone quality video, I want to put an intro video. Like I said, the first content will probably be on the Twitch channel, which should be Woodrunner Stables too. But I have to go change the name. The old channel name was Cascada Boom, so I'm I'm fixing that um, very very soon because I will probably do a live stream of a property tour um, when we will be moved in. Um, so don't expect don't expect content until June. 
uh, that I have to say mid-June. Um, but you will have some content uh, for sure. We are trying to get a video out a week. Which means I will be starting filming some content now to post on the channel in the near future. So I am very, very, very happy. Uh, I might have an, a few videos still coming up on the channel uh, here, of course. Uh, but they're more for personal experiences and travel vlogs, like I said. The other channel will mostly be for my life on the property and ranch owning. If you have any questions, drop it in the comments. Or you can post it on one of the social media. Um, I'm blocked on Instagram, so I cannot answer you on Instagram for now. Uh, but if you send me a message through TikTok or uh, Facebook, I will be able to respond to your request. So thank you very much and have a great day everybody. Bye bye.